Hello and welcome. This is Mouse Gunner, and we're back with some more RimWorld returning to a no hope playthrough. So we have a poison ship that landed, and we have done enough damage to it that the two mechanoids that are still alive are coming after me. The poison is spreading, uh, but a lot of the success of uh, dealing with the mechanoids and damaging the ship were these IEDs that I put around the ship. In the future, if I had something like this happen, I'd probably put down more so that they aren't quite as spread out because only maybe half of them actually went off. But it did drop these two uh, smaller uh, scythers, and then we have the, the centipedes themselves coming after us, both of which have taken damage. This one, the most damage at the moment. Uh, but they should be uh, aggro. They should be coming. Uh, it's close to nighttime. Ooh, I, I forgot. I had Luke... Uh, selected so that we could take pot shots. We should outrange them with the assault rifles. And if they're aggro, they may be a little bit single-minded in the way they behave. I have to keep in mind there's two of them, though, and just be careful. Okay, he's coming for me. I'm going to take another shot here and then run. The whole point of this is just to take pot shots every so often. Okay, we've got a mad animal. It is a rat. I don't really care. We're already restricted within the base. At least we should be. So nobody should get hurt by that. Okay. Taking a few shots at him. Let's back off. Um, okay, one of the generators broken down, which that might hurt our power. We also have a breakdown in the smelter, which I believe was taken care of. Okay. And the poison chip, I mean, I know about trying to deal with it. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to undraft him and let him go. It's nighttime. He wants bed. Let the mechanoids do their own thing. I expect the turrets to be able to deal with this one. I mean, it took every single one of our traps. And now it has to deal with all these. I mean, it might take some of them down because of the fire. Alright, that one's down. Good. This one has more damage, so... It is slowed down a bit, though. The fire should just go out. I mean, it's in sand. There's nothing for it to, to alight. Okay. Let's speed on up, because it's nighttime. I mean, I would, uh, ideally... Are right, you going after what? Tagging a sandstone door. What would that be? Are you going all the way over here? I don't have time for that. Friendlies. A group of friendly outlanders from have arrived nearby. Well, they might be getting killed here. All right, have fun with the uh, the mechanoid. You are coming in the same direction. I they may not actually fight the mechanoid. We'll find out here in a second. Here they come. There's also the Mad Rat, but that might be dead. Yeah, it's dead over there. Okay, they didn't end up going in the same direction after all. Hmm. Not sure where that guy's going now. Okay, Leia. Leia. Crafted. I'm assuming you've had your food. Maybe, maybe not. It's possible that... Alright, first off... Now somebody said you can just disable them. Add bill. Shut down. 
Yeah, there we go. But I, I, I don't think I can tell her to do that at the moment. So that's fine. Um, we'll just have you come in here. Might it be able to move you around and get you in a nice position to take shots at this guy? I want you to be at range though, so he can't hit you. Alternatively, I could just come down here and start shooting at the ship. Instead. Yeah, screw that. Let's go down to the ship. Ideally, what we'd want... Is there anybody else up at this point? Han can't fight, so that's... Uh, what I'd want is probably grenades uh, to do the job. Yeah, we'll try and take the mechanoid out. I mean, it's pretty damaged. We might be able to take it at this point. Not exactly sure where it's going. It might be going back to the ship, if, which if it is, I don't have time for that. Okay, it's down. So we add a bill. So that's under health. Add bill. Shut down. Okay. You can be undrafted. Everybody can be unrestricted. But... Now that you're undrafted, yeah, do that. Okay, um, Ben, Han, C-3PO. C-3PO, you're a good candidate for this. Grenades. Quit frag grenades. You guys trip one of my traps? You did, didn't you? Well, that's your fault. Okay, you're drafted now. Unless you need food. You do need food. You're undrafted. Okay. That's been taken care of. Okay, old Ben's doing that. This is why I kept the grenades around, is to do things like this. I have to be careful, though. The IDs are around. They might go off with the explosions. I'm not positive. Hopefully we get that generator fixed. It is drawing power. Draining power. Let's uh, disconnect the power here. Okay, C-3PO is doing stuff we don't want him to. Go over there. Why do they keep uh, tr tripping my traps? Oh, this guy is stuck, isn't he? Why do they keep doing that? That's dumb. All right. Let's uh, speed up. We don't really... Um, okay. Draft. Mirror. I don't know what kind of range we need to be at. For this. We did pick up that rat, didn't we? Okay. Okay, let's go to here. Hey, okay, let's go to there. There we go. Run. Okay, that worked. Let's, uh... Throw again. From this direction, hopefully setting off another one of these IEDs. Shouldn't take many more of these or it will go down. Okay, down it goes. Okay, um, undraft. Deconstruct. 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 You? Prioritize de deconstructing. I don't know if there's a chance that they'll blow up doing this. So, just to be safe, I'll have C-3PO do it. Because <laughs> uh, if she gets blown up, uh, not as much of a loss. And add bill. Shut down. This one, I think, is already dead. Good. Wow, oh, it takes a while, huh? Okay. Our ties deconstructing. We at least get the component and the uh, mortar shell back. 
And one more for you. Alright. I don't know if I want Leia in the same place. Okay, good. <laughs> I was about to say, if that IED goes off and kills a couple people, I will not be happy. Alright, well, uh, that didn't go too bad. Really wish these guys would stop walking over the traps. I'm just kind of wonder if they're, like, stuck. Their pathing is all screwed up or something. Alright, so poison chip's been taken care of. The... Even get some silver out of the deal, huh? Uh, friendlies, I don't know if I really care. Uh, they don't have tradables. No. Okay. Alright, so that immediate concern is gone. I mean, that was one of the more threatening things that can happen in the game. Is, uh... Well, these things... And this poison didn't spread to a point that, I mean, it did affect some of these plants, but I think the plants will recover. I mean, that this guy might bleed to death. But I think he'll be able to make it before that happens. And if he bleeds to death, we'll loot his corpse and that'll work out. I don't know where that guy's going. We also have the job to... Oh, we should unforbid them. Is the other one? Okay, those have already been taken care of. Um, yeah, so whoever ends up disassembling these guys. Be good. So I carved out all the silver that we saw, and we're still quite a bit down on silver. Had a apparel for C-3PO. Oh, C-3PO, now that you no longer have a grenade, probably, or a need for grenades, probably not good that you keep having one in your inventory, because I'd prefer you not blowing up the base. <laughs> or other, other colonists. We did end up fixing that, so power should be back up eventually. Mechanoise was picked up, so we're good there. And mostly we're just picking up steel and things like that. We still have the Thrumbo around, at least one of them. I don't know where the other one is. I thought there was two. Oh, the other one's over here. So we could split them up and kill them. Honestly, we've got a full boat of turrets over here, so if we could aggro it and get it to come over this way. We might be able to drop it. Uh, there's a chance the other Thrombo will come after us. Which, eh, that sucks, but uh, Thrombo Horn's worth a lot. So, could be valuable to trade if we were able to drop it. It's nighttime now, though, so... We'll wait until the morning to make a decision like that. I think shooting it once should aggro it. I don't know how fast these things are. Uh, Luke probably is the best call because he can... He's got good foot speed. So he should be able to run. If we need him to. Alright, well we might as well fast forward through the night. Nothing else is really going on. Oh, infestation. That's not ideal. I thought I did everything to uh, make sure that didn't happen. Well, now we have other concerns. And I think the longer we do something, nothing about this, the worse it's going to be. So. Charge rifle is probably the better call in this uh, circumstance. What I could do is I could cut a hole here. And try and get them to come out into the turrets. That might deal with them. I don't see any of the big boys right now, so... I'm gonna draft Luke, and it's probably gonna piss him off, but oh well. Um, 
charge rifle. Here it is. Equip that. This is not really a situation I wanted to deal with, but these things happen. Okay, there's the big boys. Um, this is going to be really tough to deal with because it's in here. I'm not exactly sure why why they came here. I guess there's no real way to make sure they don't come. I mean, maybe the smooth floors is part of it. Uh, maybe they can come through smooth floors. I wasn't aware uh, that that was something they could do, but uh, it doesn't matter. Well, the point is we have an infestation and now we have to deal with it. So as I said, I could cut a hole in the wall and try and deal with them that way. Might be the best way to deal with it. I'm going to try doing the door thing first. We're going to be nice and slow here. Biggest problem is we've got so much crap in the way, it's going to be hard to fire at this guy. Okay, let's just run. And they're going to try and smash through that door. See if we can get them to smash through this door. Okay. Hmm. Attacking my cows. Okay. Might lose the cow. Nothing I can do about that. I hope that's not the pregnant one. Nope, it's not the pregnant one. Yeah, that's what we want. We want them to come through here. When we get rid of the big boys, we'll be better off. Okay, now I think they're attacking the pregnant cow. If we lose the cows, I mean, that sucks, but it is what it is. I think that we're going to lose that cow. Okay, so they're just killing the cows. Um, that cow is actually possibly rescuable, but... I might be able to use this distraction. And now they're going to go back towards the, their nest. I mean, these, these things should be, uh, you know, wounded. So, they've been bitten, they've been, uh, shot. So, they are wounded. One of our cows is dead, another one's bleeding out. I'm gonna wait until we get some distance. All right, probably good call to run. Let's not be in the line of fire of the gun turret. Okay, down it goes. So the objective here, just aggro. As a matter of fact, none of, none of our, cow, our cows aren't dead. But they might die in the meantime. Okay. We should have aggroed it. Let's get out of there so you don't get shot by ungun turret. Fire. I would like to take these out before they take the gun turret out, but that might be unavoidable. Really? Hit your damn target. Can't believe that they, uh... Oh no. Okay. So people are waking up. That's a problem. Alright. What were you going to do? You were going to smelt... 
Uh, oh, this is so stupid. You can dra you can be drafted and go right here. Now you can run away. Baka, whatever it is you're doing is stupid. Stop it. Okay, run away. See, that's what we didn't want to have happen. Bastard colonists distracting me. Okay, we didn't have any uh, permanent injuries from that. So they're trying to kill the cows again. Well, this is actually our bull. Which I think actually managed to take out some of the enemy. Go bull. If you die, we don't have any way of replacing you, but go bull. Can you path a more intelligent way, my friend? Okay. Leia, wherever you are. Time to be drafted. Come with me. Dumb colonists. Okay, we're gonna kill the nests before they get any worse. Alright, you know what? Seriously, stand right next to it. <laughs> You're literally standing right next to it. Cannot be that hard. If I had a uh, melee weapon, I might even have... Uh, I know I have a couple colonists that have really good melee skill. We just go in there and stab the thing to death, but... These things take a lot of shots. And the problem is we're, we're damaging things. You know what? Screw that. Go do whatever. I'm trying to remember who it is that is good at close combat. It might be Ben. Yeah, Ben. Uh, but you're busy. Uh, Han, Chewbacca. Okay, Chewbacca, come in here and punch this thing. And... We'll get old Ben to punch the other one, I guess. I mean, I don't know how, what kind of damage punching it does, but we'll give it a go. For now, we'll just have old Ben take care of the cows. Um, we did have a miscarriage, according to the data, so... That does a fair amount of damage. All right, well, we're just going to fast forward here. You should have it down pretty soon. Okay. Go go punch the other thing. Okay, you can unforbid this. Start eating it. Um, we're not out of meat, so I'm going to keep up the fine meal. Has he been treated? No. Because old Ben's too busy treating cows. He'll get there eventually, I guess. Hopefully we get this over with before anything else pops out of it. Alright. 
Undraft. Unforbid. Well, that was fun. And I forgot what it was I was going to do. I was going to attack a Thrumbo. Well, I guess not. The bull did a good job. He was able to fight off the insects. Uh, we did end up losing turret and a couple doors, all of which we're going to have to replace. And the sooner we get on that, the better. Let's uh, work on that wooden door. Because that's going to mess up the climate control of our base if we don't. There we go. Okay, he should be treated now. We must have had one of the cows die on us. Maybe the calves. One of the calves died. So we only have... Oh, the bull died. Well, we have no more uh, way for these uh, to procreate. So I guess there goes our run of uh, of cow, cow breeding. We could always buy another bull. I mean, that's how we got it in the first place. But that's a bummer. As I said, the bull did good work fighting off the last of the insects. And one of our turrets just broke down. Lovely. That is one of the scarier threats, though, and the fact that it uh, was dealt with and we didn't really lose anyone outside of the cows. I mean, I guess that's good. So, that's two infestations in the same area. I think we had one over here and one in here now. And I I'm starting to wonder, is it did they come through the ceiling? It's possible. Let's see. I know it says something about the... Doesn't it say something? Overhead mountain. I don't know if there's anything you can do about that, though. I don't think so. So. Oh, good. We have a mad animal. Well. It's a mega scarab. And I don't really care, so uh, I can do as I will, I guess. Now, in theory, it could come up here and be a problem, but... I think this is a good point to go ahead and uh, put a cut in the video. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. This is Mouse Gunner, signing out.